Hi, and welcome to the next section of our course. We're going to talk about hands-on API testing and how to get started with it. As we go through this course, we're going to be learning a lot of stuff, but I don't want you to just listen to what I'm saying. I want you to actually try this stuff out. Don't just follow along, but actually sit down and try it and do it. So to help with this, I've created a few testing challenges that can be used to practice some of the things that we're talking about. To get started with these challenges, you'll need to download a small repository from GitHub. If you already have Git on your computer and are familiar with it, go ahead and do that the way that you normally would. If you don't have Git, I would suggest that you download and use the GitHub desktop. So the GitHub desktop makes it fairly easy to download and use different repositories. So we can see that I have here the API testing challenges set up on this, but if you don't have it, you can go ahead and get it from desktop.github.com. If you go to that site, you can download it and follow along with the install. I won't walk you through that as that's pretty basic stuff, but install it, set it up. It's very straightforward to do. Once you've got it installed and set up locally, you'll need to actually get the repo downloaded. So the way to do that in GitHub desktop is to go to file, clone repository, and we'll go to URL here. And we we'll put in the URL that we want to download. So in this case, we'll start with HTTPS colon slash slash github.com. And it's on my personal GitHub. So DJ Wester. And it's called API testing challenges dot get. Now I've already got this set up on mine. So I'm not going to clone it. But once you're done this, you just hit the clone button. And it will go ahead and download everything that you need and clone it into whatever folder you've chosen here. So we could choose API testing or some other folder that you have on your computer. Once it's downloaded and cloned onto your computer, we're still going to need to install it. So to do that, we're going to use something called npm. If you don't have npm, you can see this npmjs.com slash get dash npm. Go to that site and you can very easily download and install npm from there. Once you've done that, you'll just need to open a command prompt. And let's navigate into the folder where I have it. So API testing and then API testing challenges. And now that we're in here, we'll need to install things. So we can do that with npm that you should have installed and we just npm install and what that will do is install all the dependencies and everything that you need to be able to run the testing challenges I'm not going to do that at this point because I've already installed it but all you have to do is type npm install and then hit enter and it will install all the dependencies and packages that you need to be able to run the challenges and now you should be ready to go with the API testing challenges